All right, and we're back, and hopefully the things will be a little bit better. As we had a lot of trouble in the last video, we tried to play some PC Replay basketball, and yeah, it just um, it crashed on me, and then when I booted it back up, it was really creeping along. And that, that game is, sometimes it does that. That game will, I, I like the game a lot, but once in a while you'll get a, either a bad boot up or a bad startup or something, and holy cow, that game just, uh, it just creeps along and waiting for dice rolls, and it, it was just painfully slow, and I said, no, I'm not going to put anybody through that, even, even myself. I'm not going to put myself through that. Um, so, so let me just make sure that we are rolling. I had to delete the last, I actually deleted the last one. I was just like, yeah, we're not going to do that. So hopefully we're back. Yep, there we go. Okay, so we're going to do some baseball tonight here <clears throat> on the channel. I was going to try to do some basketball, but that didn't work out. Uh, as I mentioned, uh, the rink is closed again tonight, so no work again. Boy, I'm getting a lot of time with you guys here. <laughs> just, I'm just not making any money at the rink. So, uh, so anyway, so uh, if you remember, so let's let's get down, let's get right down to it here. We'll get right down to the field. Uh, we are playing uh, the 1976 season, and on my team, I have put uh, Reggie Jackson. And also Mark Fidrich, if you remember that. So those two guys are on my team. Now, it looks like Jackson's not in the lineup tonight. I let the computer handle a lot of this stuff here. Um, wait a sec. Wait a sec. Is Jackson over here? That can't be. Oh, Ron Jackson. Okay, good. <laughs> it's like if they put Reggie Jackson on the Angels, I'd be pretty bummed out. So it looks like he's not playing tonight, which is fine. We'll give him the night off. Uh, but it's going to be Nolan Ryan and Louis Tiant be going at it tonight. And so uh, I like to quick play this. I might slow down late in the game and do some pitching. But um, anyway, we are on the road. We're in Anaheim tonight. And the Sox are 9-4. and four, The Angels are 4-8. and eight. So let's see what Nolan Ryan's going to uh, bring tonight for the Angels. So we got Rick Miller. So let's go. Uh, he uh, grounds. Oh, I'm sorry. I hit the wrong button. It has been a while. So he grounds out to the shortstop one away. So now it's going to be uh, Dwight Evans. Evans takes the pitch. And he uh, strikes out. Uh-oh. So now Jim Rice up, two away. Rice um, struck out as well. Holy cow. One, two, three for Nolan Ryan. I guess he is pretty good back in 76. All righty, so we're going to go uh, in the one pitch mode here, I think. And he slaps this one. Yeah, ground ball. Um. Oh, that was Jerry Remy. Oh, Remy's playing with the... Uh, that's right, he played with the Angels, didn't he? He grounded out the, the Burleson down short. So, yeah, so I did. I do remember that. Remy with the Angels. Wow, it's been a while since I played this. Bruce Bakhti up. And again, if I wanted to, I could go to player mode and just kind of uh, pitch around the guys, but I'll do that later in the game. Tiant delivers this one, and that's ball four. So we got a man on with one away. And it's going to be, uh, who's up now? Collins here. Dave Collins. Collins. Uh-oh. Stolen base. Uh, Bakhti stole second. Wow. So we get Bakhti at second now. And Collins, uh-oh. Fly ball in the center. And who makes the catch out there in center? That's going to be Rick Miller making the catch. So Bakhti stays at second, and we get two outs now. And here comes the pitch from Tiant, and he struck him out. So Rusty Torres is Rusty Jones, and he goes down. All right, so nothing, nothing after one. I do, I do like this baseball game here. i got to say, this is a fun baseball game. Being a casual baseball guy, I like this game. I like how I have my scoreboard up on the left. Uh, on the right-hand side over here, um, kind of near my head, I have some of the things going on in the game. And then below me, we have the, the pitcher and the batter. In the lineup, everything's right here on the screen. I do like how they set this up. Okay, so Colin Fisk comes up. He's got his socks hat in the pitcher. That's kind of funny. His white socks. Ground ball back to the pitcher. That was one away. And now it's going to be Cooper. The Coop's at first base. And he draws a walk. All right, so the Sox got a man on right here. And now Hobson comes up. Hobson knuckles this down to first. And okay. Now Burleson's here. Wow, Burleson's way back here. Burleson usually leads off, but he's way back down here tonight. That's okay. Well, uh, we're, we're shaking up the lineup tonight. Burleson now trying to get something going. He slaps this down to first as well. No, it goes into right field. 
and that'll score a run. So Burleson, the speedy little Burleson, gets in the second, and that will score Hobson or Cooper. No, Cooper scores on that one there. Okay. And it's one nothing. All right. So one nothing Sox. So still two away here in the inning. Where's my outs? There it is right here. Right in front of me. That's my outs. i got to get used to the screen again. All right, so it's uh, Dillard, Steve Dillard, who's playing second base tonight. And Dillard will fly this one to second base. I'm trying to see where he went. I have the uh, everything quick on right here. So all right, so the Sox get a run, though, on the double by Burleson, and they lead this one one to nothing here in the second. So we get Ron Jackson up now. Jason Tion, Jackson, struck him out. All right, Bill Melton comes up. That's one of the reasons I don't like to use pitches too much because they always have their different um, their different hat on than the team that I'm playing them on because they moved around a lot. So it, it kind of throws me off when I see a White Sox hat and I'm playing the Angels, but we move on. And he slaps this one. That's a double into right field down the first baseline. And so Melton's on with one away, and now Herman comes up. It's Ed Herman. Herman takes the pitch. Uh-oh, he slaps this one. That's a back-to-back -back doubles, and the game is tied. So Herman drives in Melton, and Louis Tiant is a melting down right now. Tiant pitches to Stanton, and Stanton strikes out. He had a Mariners hat on. Finally, somebody with an A's hat on, Dave Chalk. I remember Dave Chalk. Chalk with two outs, man in scoring position. Chalk. What happened? He whiffed. Didn't say that he struck out after going in the right. So he whiffs. All right. So we get on the inning, but they tie it up on a pair of doubles. And so now Bernie Cabo comes up. He's the DH hitting last, by the way. Okay. That's fine. And he's facing Nolan Ryan. Ryan pitches. Carbo strikes out. Yikes. How many um, strikeouts does he have in this game? Is there any way to see what um, pitcher game stats pitch. No, it doesn't tell me what's going on with the pitchers. I'd like to see how many strikeouts he has so far. Um, box score. Let's see here. Oh, here we go. Um, Louis Tion. Wow, four strikeouts for Tion and three for um, Nolan Ryan. Hmm, interesting. All right, so back to the top of the order. Rick Miller. Miller, he strikes out. So that's four strikeouts each. Dewey comes up. Two outs. Dewey Evans, and he will take a walk. He'll take a free base. All right, so Jimmy Rice. Come on, pitchers pay the price. When they face Jim Rice, he hits this one into center field, but moving in, and that's Torres making the catch, and that's the inning. So we go to the bottom of the third here in California, somewhere in California, Anaheim Stadium it looks like. One to one. All right, Remy slaps this one down to second, and he is out. As who's that? Dillard. Dillard makes the play. Dillard's at second base tonight for the Sox. Tiant delivers. Uh oh, Bakti fly ball, and, and that's going to be uh, out to left. So who's in left today? Uh, Rice. Jim Rice slides over and makes that catch. Sometimes the graphics fool me in this game. All righty, and now we get a. Um, Strike him out, Collins. <clears throat> Sit down. Yeah, Collins strikes out. All right. All right, so top of the fourth. So we got Fisk, Cooper, and Hobsons. Fisk slaps that one in the center, and that's going to be caught by Torres. One away. Cooper is up. Cooper's got the only run of the game, I believe. Cooper, he hits this one and hits it in the center as well. Torres has been busy out there in center field. So here comes Hobson. Hops in, and he whiffed. All right, one, two, three again for the Angels. One to one, bottom of the fourth. Tian facing Rusty Torres. Torres strikes out. Strike him out. Tian now to Ron Jackson. Ron Jackson pops this one up short, and that's going to be Burleson under it. Makes the catch two away. Tian dealing to Melton, and he threw it outside. He walked him. On five pitches, it looks like. All right, so man on base, the go-ahead run, and it's going to be um, Ed Herman, who doubled the last time he was up, I believe. 
And Herman slaps this one down to first. And this time it's going to be taken by Cooper, who makes the play. Nice. And we go to the fifth here in my What If 1976. And here comes the pitch. Oh, pops this one up. And, oh, that's an error. So he pops this one up, and the catcher dropped the ball. And uh, Burleson will take first base. Thank you very much. So what do we want to do? Swing away. Steal second. Let's steal. There we go. Burleson takes off, and he's caught stealing. 74% chance, and he is caught. And a fly ball by Dillard. And now Carbo, the bottom of the lineup. And Carbo whiffs. Not a good inning. They got a guy on. And we couldn't do nothing with it. So Leroy Stanton comes up. Apparently he played with the Mariners at one point. He grounds it down to first base. And Cooper makes the play. Dave Chalk coming up now in a tie game. Dave Chalk, he hits this one into the outfield, and the right fielder comes over. That is Dwight Evans will make the catch. Two away. Jerry Remy now, who's got his Boston hat up, well, hat on, playing for the Angels. R.I.P. Rem Dog. Remy hits this one down to first. Cooper makes it unassisted, I believe, and that'll end the inning. So we go to the six. Still one to one here in Anaheim. We could be here a while. And a walk. So Rick Miller walks, and now it's Dwight Evans up as the top of the lineup comes up for the Sox. Evans, he takes a walk, too. Oh, boy. So Jim Rice comes up with two on and nobody out whatsoever. Rice, wild pitch. And the runners move up. Holy cow. I would try a bunt right here, but not with Rice. Maybe with Fisk. So nobody out. Rice up with runners at second and third. And Rice hits this one into the outfield, and that's a single, and that'll score them both. So Miller and Evans come home, and the Sox lead this one 3-1 to one here in the sixth, and there's still absolutely nobody out. Fisk at the plate. I don't think we're going to steal. Look at a 73% chance. Let's try it. Go ahead, Rice. 84. Take off. And he gets in. Okay, good. So he's in there. So Rice is at second now. Still nobody out. Fisk hits this one. It's going to be a triple into the gap. Rice will come all the way around to score. And the Sox have put up a three spot here in the sixth inning. And they lead this one now four to one. And it's going to be Cooper now. Come on, Coop. With Fisk on third. Get it to the outfield. Oh, he whiffed. I think he struck out like every time tonight. Um, you like the photos, uh, uh, Fenner? Um, I think, I don't know how this happened here. I don't, I don't know. I think they were automatic. They don't come with the game because they can't put them in the game. But somehow, some way, they're in. I think maybe I, um, I downloaded a file and installed them. or I don't quite remember how I did the uh, the graphics for this. But it couldn't have been hard if I did it. Let's put it that way. So whatever I did, it worked out. Um, but all the players are here. I, th I think maybe I downloaded a. Uh, I think I downloaded a zip file and just unzipped into a folder, and it just did it automatically. I'm I'm pretty sure because I wouldn't have put them in one by one. So I think it was something like that. So we got a. Um, it was one away. Hobson up now, with a man on third. Come on, get it up there. No, oh, he grounds ball. Oh, but he comes home. So he grounded it to third. It must have been a hot shot down to the line, and Fisk comes home. So they got four now in the inning. So Burleson comes up with bases clear, and Burleson will single up the middle. We keep the inning going. So now it's going to be uh, Steve Phyllis Dillard. Dillard slaps this down to first, and that's going to be an easy play down there for Melton. And he wraps up the inning. But they get four. The Sox lead this one 5-1. to one. And Bakhti, high fly ball at second base. And uh, Dill is going to get that one, one away. So now we get Dave Collins up now. Collins hit this one in the center. And that's going to drop in for a base hit. So we got a man on right now with one away. And it's Torres 
at the plate. Torres, uh-oh, he doubles, and it's second and third. Collins holds, and oh, boy, so the the Angels got something going on right here. Do I intentionally walk the bases loaded? Yeah, we're going to walk the bases loaded. So now we're going to play for the double play. We've got Melton up. He's one for one. So let's see if we can get something going here. We're going to go drive the lines, intentional walk for Straight away, all right. Double play depth, I guess. And he struck him out. Strike down. All right, so Melton's down, so there's two away. The bases are loaded, though. Yeah. Still dangerous times here for the Sox. Herman. Oh, he walks the man home. How do you walk a man home, Louie? Come on. And we're in the sixth inning. And, uh-oh, hits this one in the left field. But coming in is Rice, and he'll take that on the line drive, and they get out of the jam. All right, we go to the seventh. Nolan Ryan is still on the mound. He's going to face Carbo, and then the top of the lineup here. Ryan delivers, and he walks him. Hmm. So I wonder how to tell if the pitchers are getting tired here. And this one's going to be lifted in the center for a single by Rick Miller. All right, so Cabo and Miller are on. Dwight Evans at the plate. I think we're going to um, sacrifice bunt here. See if we can get the sacrifice bunt. Does he drop it down? It's an error. Holy cow. The catcher bobbles that one. That's two errors on her man in this game. And the bases are loaded with nobody out. And the Sox looking to add to their lead. And it's Jim Rice. This is the guy you want coming up. Jim, oh, I notice I have no Yaz and no Reggie Jackson in this game. The computer actually gave them the night off. So, unfortunately, you don't get to see my good lineup tonight. Rice, uh-oh, grounds it to second. That scores a run. Everybody moves up a base. And they get the sure play at first. So, Fisk up now. See if we can get it in the outfield, get one more run in here. Fisk hits us down to third and scores a run. So they go to first for the only play. So Fisk gets his J-O-B done. And we get two more runs in for the Sox. They lead now 7-2. to two. Still a man in scoring position for Cooper, who is 0 for everything today. And Cooper strikes out for the third time. <laughs> Cooper is just terrible. Oh, man. Let me, let me um, see if I can get the Cooper stats. Cooper. Uh, oh, he struck out twice. So he got a walk. He scored on the walk, and then he struck out twice, and I don't know what else he's done, but he's, he's been absolutely terrible today, a aside from the walk, which anybody can get. All right, so we go to the bottom of the seventh. Tiant still on the mound. And here comes the pitch. Chalk hits it down to short, and the rooster has it, and there is one away. Jerry Remy up, top of the order, Rem Dog. Remy, oh, he hits this one. Into right field and coming over to make the catch is Evans. So there's two away. Tiant trying to get this one, two, three. Bakhti, no, he's going to rip a single in the right. Yeah, boy. All right, so there's a man on. All right, still seven to two socks here in the seventh. Dave Collins up now. Collins will hit this one down to second base. And that's the inning is over. So I don't know if he, they made the double play or not. Just that he grounded the second. So the inning's over, so we're going to go to the top of the eighth. And it is uh, Sox 7 and the Angels 2. And I'm kind of bummed I don't have my uh, Reggie Jackson or Yaz in the game because I did put Reggie Jackson on the Sox. But we just played the next game in the season. As we uh, just try to have some fun tonight here on the channel. I got a rare Monday night off. So we're going to have some fun here tonight. I might even come back later on with some hockey. Who knows? And um, let's see. Hobson strikes out. So now it's Burleson up here in the top of the eighth. Burleson hits this one to short. Nice play by the shortstop. Chalk. And Burleson's out. Dillard wraps that one into left field for a double. Wow. And now so they're going to bring in Sid Monge now coming in for the Angels. He has his Cleveland hat on. I hate, I hate those pitches when they do that. It drives me nuts. But um, Sid Monge will come in. 
as we're playing 1976. April 15th, we're real early in the season. And uh, again, I have Reggie Jackson and Mark Fridrich on the Red Sox in my what-if season here, just having some fun. So let's see what he can do here. We got two outs, Dillard on second, and Bernie Cabo, the DH, is up here facing Sid Monge. And, ooh, nice little pitch there, and he struck out Cabo to get out of the inning. So we go to bottom of the eighth. Tiant is still on the mound. Looks like he's still got 98 endurance. Is that right? So we're going to keep Tiant on the mound. And struck him out. He struck him out. All righty. Um, oh, there is the stuff right here. Okay, I didn't see that over here. Cause I'm still fairly new with this game. Looks like he's got eight strikeouts and four walks. Okay, it does show everything here, so I don't have to go to the box score. Um, oh, I'm happy with that now. I'm, I'm, I'm happy. See my smile? Okay, so one out, and it's going to be Ron Jackson. And he slaps it down to third, and nice play by Hobson down there at third, and Clell makes the play. And it's going to be two outs now. Tiant is going to face Bill Melton. Melton, uh-oh, hits this one deep into left field, but Rice will go back. Plenty of room out there in the outfield. He'll make the catch. So we go to the top of the ninth. Sox still leading this one 7-2 to two, as I have some fun here in Baseball Mogul 22, I think this is. No, 21, 2021. 20, and here comes the pitch. Wrap down a second. Dwight Evans. Is up now as Rick Miller grounded out to the Rem Dog. One away. What are my options here? Just hit. Yeah, just hit. Evans. Oh, he got all of this one. Way back. Way back. And this is gone. So Evans rips one off of Sid Monge to make it 8-2 to two here in the top of the ninth. He got all of that one. Jimmy Rice up now. He's had a big day today. Rice is uh, one for four. Three RBIs. He has in this game. Very nice. Rice. And he's trekking out. So there's two away here in the ninth. And it's going to be Carlton Fisk at the plate. Carlton Fisk. And he's trekking out. So we go to the bottom of the ninth. The Sox enjoying a six-run league. Tiant still on the mound trying to close this one out. He's got the bottom of the lineup. He's got Herman right now. Herman struck him out. Nine strikeouts for Louie Louie in this game. Stanton is at the plate. 0 for 3. He hits this one. He's 0 for 4 as he flies that one into right. And Evans make the catch. And the Angels are down to their last out. Here it is. Louie trying to go the distance. Chalk at the plate. And Chalk will fly this one in the right field. And that will end the game. So the Sox win this one 8-2. to two. Let's take a look at the stats, shall we? All right. So here's what happened in this game. Louis Tian going the distance, a five-hitter against the Angels in this one. He had nine strikeouts and a 3.41 ERA. I don't know what how he got that, but okay, that's fine. Uh, well, he allowed two runs, four walks, okay. Nolan Ryan, he went seven and two-thirds. He uh, had nine strikeouts. Nolan Ryan played really well, but unfortunately they hit him six times, and that was good enough for seven runs. Sid Monge came in, played the last inning in a third. He gave up that home run to, uh, I think that was Evans, right, to get the home run. Yep, Evans got the only home run of the game. And let's see if there's any other notables in here. <clears throat> Um, let's see. Pearlson had two hits in an RBI. Steve Dillard had a hit. Nice job. And Carlton Fisk. He had a hit in a couple of RBIs and struck out one time. I don't know what these numbers here mean next to them. That's one thing I don't know. Oh, doubles. Oh, okay. Doubles. Okay. So Burleson had a double. It's his fourth double of the season. Dillard had a double. It's his first double. Uh, Fisk has a triple. Evans had his first home run. Is that what it is? And CS. Hmm. Like I said, I'm not a baseball guy, so I don't really know what CS means. CS. Not sure. I'll have to find out. Uh, boy, these guys, yeah, they had doubles. They had Melton, Torres, and Herman all had doubles. And uh, Herman made two errors. I think Herman was the catcher. He made two errors in this game. 
Uh, winning pitcher, again, is Tiant. And Nolan Ryan takes the loss. Nolan Ryan's 0-4 in this replay. Yikes. Can you imagine that? 36,500 people watched this game. That was a fun one. Sox over Anaheim. Let's go to my standings now. So the Sox now improved to 10-4. And, and California is now 4-9. and nine. Take a look at my Red Sox team here. And, yep, so I had uh, Yaskremski and Reggie Jackson and Fred Lynn. Wow, all my good guys were on the bench in this game. We still won this game. Caught stealing. Thank you, Richard. Caught, thank you so much. I Again, I don't know all my baseball lingo like I used to. So it is caught stealing. Yeah, he was caught stealing. The only guy that got caught stealing. And, uh, yeah, so that's where we are here. So let's see if I sort by averages. Boston Red Sox this season versus both stats. I wonder if I can sort by anything. Um, oh, Burleson's tired. Rice is tired, so I got to take them out. Hmm. So caught stealing. Okay, yep, I I got that there. Uh, sort the lineup. I don't know how I can sort it here. Hmm. We sort lineup for injuries. For stats, save metrics, ratings. Hmm. Take a look at my pitching. So Fidrich uh, is this season. How can I be 15-3 and three if I just started here? I'm in April. I couldn't have played that many games. Five in for stats, stats, save metrics, ratings. All stats shown last season, this season. Hmm. This is uh, this is kind of screwy here because I I haven't played. He there's no way he could play 15 games in April. Well, maybe I'm just not doing something right here. Oh well. Team stats, batting at 276. We're first place at 10 and four. Go to my leaders. Maybe I can find them in here. Um, wins. Okay, Fidrich has three wins. Ah, here we go. Okay, so he's three and zero. Oh. He's he's uh he's started four games and he's three and zero oh for my Red Sox. Okay, so I guess that's how I'm gonna have to do it here. Fergie Jenkins is doing well. Fergie Jenkins. Um. Hmm. Oh, three, three and three as well. So he's played three games. He's won three. Okay. He's doing pretty good. Hmm. And that is that. So let me go back to Studio B. Again, I'm still not very good with all the baseball stuff, but I still enjoy playing baseball. In fact, I think I'm going to um pick up the demo for that uh inside pitch PC game. I like the inside sports games. I do. I don't know why I just do. Uh, they just they just I like clicking around and watching the things play out. I really do like that. So I might get the demo for that and see how that goes. But anyway, all right. While we play a little baseball tonight here on the channel, we tried to play some basketball earlier, but we had technical difficulties with the basketball game. So we played some baseball tonight instead. And um, I might come back on a little bit later. I'm going to go watch some hockey. Maybe I'll come because I'm not working tonight. So I'll be up late tonight. So maybe I'll come back with some hockey later on. And, uh, anyway, hey, but thanks for uh, watching tonight. And, uh, hey, Richard, thanks for um, sorting out uh, what, what that was because I, I just didn't know. You know, again, I'm not the baseball guy. So thanks for um, pointing that out. And we will talk to uh, 